Bentley. Oh, Dad. I thought... Mike, you're the boyfriend. You have to ask, what do we got now? So, Dad, what do we got now? This is a sweet potato. What are we doing with it first? What's that? What are you doing over there? There's I'm a random gonna, lady um, in the back. I'm Vanna White. I'm just going to peel the skin off. You can leave the skin on if you prefer. It just gives a little extra color. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> but also gives you a little extra dirt. But sometimes dirt is good. They got a restaurant in Paris where they're serving dirt, actually. <laughs> and it's very, um, very nutritious. It has a lot of nutrients. Don't cut yourself. Yes, you got to be careful. You should cut away from the... You're not cutting I'm away. I'm going to go flip my, um, my you want steak. Want me to flip the steak? Sure. Assistant. Flip it over? Is there, a, are there tongs out there? Bobby yes, there will be so flipping the steak. The end of the grill. We weren't supposed to say there was steak. This is a vegetarian show. Oh, there will be no steak here. They're, uh, they're meatless steaks. Yeah. <laughs> Now I like to add sweet potato pasta because it just adds a little bit more color. A little bit more color and a little bit more flavor. <laughs> and so I put this sweet potato into my spirulini. This is one of my favorite kitchen machines. You'll see this is for making raw pasta. Uh-oh, I don't see it working and very well. Just turn this. And hopefully, <laughs> it engages. Here we go. Now we got it coming. Are you supposed to be doing that? Ah, oh. See that? Isn't that beautiful? Nice curls. Isn't it? I love it. Now you could add this. <laughs> getting a little clogged over there, Mr. Some, some batter. You could put this in in a, uh, a breaded, and, and you can bread this and put it in the fryer and you have wonderful sweet potato curly fries. But when you do that, you want to use the thicker uh, blade so that your, uh, <laughs> your potatoes have a little bit more substance to them. You should put a catcher on this thing. I realize it's all over the counter. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> You won't want to season your counter, so that way, as the, the, the pasta falls onto the counter, it also gets seasoned. Two and one. Now what? Now this, oops. There we go. I don't want to tell you what you could do with this. <laughs> Uh-oh. Now we add this. Oh, look at that wonderful color. See that? The green and the white. And Dad and the just went orange. to the bathroom and didn't wash his hands. So to blend it all together it makes yes. it look nice. Beautiful. This is beautiful. <laughs> Isn't this wonderful? Now if we come back in after the commercial break, what are we going to be seeing? Well, I'm going to cut up one more zucchini because I only have one left. Oh no, I got two left. Oh. Is that enough in there for all of us? Probably not. Probably. <laughs> all right, we'll say that it is. Now this, this is I dice these tomatoes and peppers. I'm gonna add it to some olive oil, some salt, and some vinegar, and I'm gonna throw a little bit of uh, uh, minced garlic in here. This is wonderful. Wonderful. Uh, here we go, and a little bit of uh, Parmesan uh, cheese, just for a little extra flavor. <laughs> here we go. That should be enough. You know, there's no measuring, it's just kind of experience, you know, just experience. You know, you get a feel for these things. Of course, this is the first time I've ever done anything like this, but it doesn't matter. All right. All right, we're coming to a commercial break. More GMAT stuff to come.